Hello, wonder friends. Today we are going to draw a very cute teddy bear right now. Wonder friends, today we are going to draw a cute little teddy bear. All right, so we're going to start with our page up and down. And before we get started, uh, just in case you need to know this, if you draw different to me, that's good. That's the point. I want you to draw different to me. And if you feel like I'm going too fast and you messed up, uh, don't worry about it. Just get a new piece of paper, start over. Nobody will know. All right, guys, so with our page up and down, we're going to start right in the center. And it's very, very simple. We're going to start with an oval just like that. Now on each side of that oval, I want you just to put in this, it's kind of like a droopy little like hot dog kind of shape, right? And we can bring that up just like that. Okay, now on this outside, I want you just to make a circle on each side, just like this. And in between, it's just gonna be a line that's gonna connect it. You could probably already start to see the teddy bear come to life, right? And on each side of this, we're gonna put two ovals just like so. Now I'm going to switch over to the little smaller Sharpie so it's a little bit easier to put in some of these details. And we're gonna put an oval on the bottom of each one of those. And if you want to clean up anything, like I've had some edges here that I would like to clean up, you can do that with this one. Um, we're also going to put some circles inside of each of these. Okay, now for the belly, uh, we're just going to put a zero right there on the belly. Now if you want, you can put some sort of uh, smiley face or anything like that that you would like on there. That's up to you. Um, and I'm going to put a couple little just these little, like this, this just kind of shows a little bit of fur, right? And it also shows that there is, put some lines on there if you want for like the toes. It also shows that it would be like a, a stuffed animal, right? It's got a little bit of fur to it. These are just little tiny details that help just make your illustration look a little bit different, okay? Now, in the middle of this, we're gonna draw the face. I want you to pretend that there's an imaginary line running right down the middle of that. And on each side of that, we're going to put little zeros, okay? Little tiny dots. Try to get them as even as you can. And then we're just gonna color them in all except for the edge. We're gonna leave that little bit of edge there. Now, if you think about any teddy bear that you have, why the edge is because they're plastic eyes. And if you look at them in the light, one side of it will have a little bit of a shine to it, just like that. So that's what we're going for. And then right below it, we're gonna put a tiny little nose. And that's just gonna be a straight line with a little half circle that comes back across the other way. And then let's put a little tiny smile on there, just like that. And then around the whole thing, let's just put a circle just like so. And for some eyebrows, let's do some little ovals. Just like so, okay? I'm gonna fill those in. I'm not gonna fill them in all the way because I wanna add a little bit of texture and stuff like that to it. And then I'm gonna do the same sort of little thing. I'm gonna put a couple of these little hair lines around here. And I'm gonna put a couple maybe on top of its head. If you wanna put a bow in its hair or any extra stuff on here, now's a great time to do it. If you wanna add any extra details, as far as like, you wanna put a tongue hanging out, if you wanna put a bigger mouth on it, if you wanna add a hat to it, anything else that you wanna do, you can do all those things to this. You can start with just this drawing and start all over and get a new one going where you add in extra details and stuff like that. But this is where I'm going to pause this and start to color from. So right now is a great time if you need to go get some colored paper or colored pencils and markers or crayon lines or whatever you'd like to color with. Um, I'm going to fast forward the video so you don't have to watch me color the whole time. But if you want to color just like me, just pause the video at the end and then you can do that. So we're going to fast forward the video.
Okay, guys, as you start to wrap this up, if you need to grab any fine point markers and add any extra details, now's a good time to do that stuff. And then uh, if I can find mine, there it is. Um, you can add any extra little details that you would like on there, like little dots, or little whiskers, or any other little extra stuff that you would like to put on there extra for any of those things like this. You can do all those things to this and add all those extra pieces if you want. Um, last thing that you need to do is sign your name on this so everybody knows who made this awesome piece of art. All right, friends, I hope you had a good time drawing that teddy bear with me. Now remember, it's just really simple shapes, right? You can change up those shapes any way that you want. Maybe you draw the body bigger or the head smaller. Have some fun and draw it in different ways. It doesn't have to be the exact same way every time but you can understand how each one of those things makes up a different teddy bear. Put some, like, a uh, bow on it. Put hair on it. Put a wig on it. Put a mustache on it. Have some fun creating whatever teddy bear that you would like to do. Speaking of fun, check out these next videos that are coming up where you might learn something that you think that you can't draw. But with a little bit of help and lots of practice, you're going to be able to draw that and more, plus drawing. It's pretty cool. Hey, Wonder Friends, I would love to see the art you create and feature it on one of my videos. With the help of an adult, take a photo of your finished art and post it on Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter. Don't forget to tag me so I can find it. Hey, are you looking for a signed copy of one of my books? Check out my website, wondervillestudios.com for books, t-shirts, mugs, and more. I also do loads of school visits and would love to hear from you about scheduling a visit. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and check out all the other fun drawing lessons. Until I see you, be the weird you want to see in the world. See ya!